Hello friends, welcome to Engineering Funda family. In this video, I will explain bitrate and baudrate with great clarity. First of all, I will explain basics of bitrate and baudrate. After that, I will solve three interesting examples based on bitrate and baudrate. So let us start this video with first agenda that is basics of bitrate and baudrate. First of all, let me define bitrate. See bitrate that is number of bits per second. Usually I denote bitrate by capital R that is number of bits per second and when you talk about baud rate so that is number of symbols per second. Sometimes it is also referred as elements per second. So bitrate is number of bits per second and baud rate is number of symbols per second. If you have n number of bits per symbol then n is bitrate divided by baud rate. And based on number of bits per symbol, one can identify total number of symbols. Total number of available symbols, that is L is equals to 2 to the power N. If you have N bits per symbol, then total possible symbols are 2 to the power N as we are talking about digital symbols, right? So based on this understanding, I'll solve three examples. Let me explain first example. See here in first example, we have analog signal carries 4 bits per signal element and here we are having 1000 signal elements per second. Elements means symbol. So question is to identify bit rate. So here we have been given with 4 bits per signal element means small n is equals to 4. Here we have 1000 signal elements per second means we have been given with baud rate. So small r that is given that is 1000 and unit is baud. Here we need to identify bit rate means capital R that we need to identify. So to calculate bit rate one should know baud rate into n small r into n that is bit rate. So here bit rate will be 1000 into 4, right? Data is given to us. So bit rate will be 4000 bits per second and it will be 4 kbps. Here you just observe, I have written small b. Small b means bits per second. If it is mentioned like capital B, then that is bytes per second, right? If you write capital B over here, in that case, you will have to divide it by 8. So it will be 0 0.5 K capital B PS means kilobytes per second, right? Now let me solve second question. See in second question, here we have analog signal that is having bit rate of 8000 BPS and baud rate of 1000 baud, right? So here we have been given with bit rate capital R that is 8000 BPS and we have been given with baud rate being small r that is 1000 baud. Here first question is how many data elements are carried by each signal element? So here we need to understand how many data elements means how many bits are there with signal element means we need to calculate small n, right? And second question is how many distinct signal elements are required? So here we need to identify how many symbols are present, right? So here we have bit rate and baud rate. So based on that, we can identify number of bits per symbol that is capital R by small r. So that is 8000 divided by 1000. So we have 8 bits per symbol that one can say, right? Now based on that one can understand how many different elements are there. So total number of different elements L that is 2 to the power N. So that is 2 to the power 8 means it will be 256. Right. So it will be there in terms of labels or one can say 
it can be number of symbols or one can say it can be number of elements right now let me solve last question of this video see in third question we have analog signal that is carrying digital data at a bit rate of 48000 bps each signal element carries 6 bits so here we have been given with data where we have bit rate capital r that is of 48000 small bps means bits per second here each element is having 6 bits means small n is given that is 6 bits right first question is to identify baud rate means we need to identify small r second question is to calculate distinct signal levels means we need to identify total number of symbols that is capital L right so here we have bit rate and number of bits per element so based on that baud rate will be bit rate divided by n so bit rate is 48000 and baud rate is 48000 divided by n that is 6 so it will be 8000 baud right so that is how one can identify baud rate and always remember baud rate will be lower than bit rate right here second question is to identify number of elements right so that is 2 to the power n so that is 2 to the power 6 means 64 levels right so that is how one can solve questions based on bit rate baud rate number of bits per symbol as well as total number of symbols right still if you have any confusion just place that in comment section i'll be happy to help you thank you so much for watching this video